Hey there YouTubers again. Um, so I well thank thank God I I still have a bit of time tonight before I have to hibernate to you know to to shoot a Bible reading session and I I always welcome those who are willing to, to join me. So um, for tonight I like to give it a go for the um, you know the Revelation, the Book of Revelation, or you know the Revelation of Saint John the Divine. It's as shown here by this printed Bible. I don't know if you can see it, but um, well, it it appears what um, the camera films there shows the mirror image. I'm I'm not sure um, how it will turn out once I finish filming. But um, anyway, without further ado, let us begin. The Revelation, the book of Revelation, of Saint John the Divine, the revelation of Jesus Christ, which God gave unto him, to show unto his servants things which must shortly come to pass. And he sent and signified it by his angel unto his servant John, who bear record of the word of God, and of the testimony of Jesus Christ, and of all things that he saw. Blessed is that is he that readeth, and they that hear the words of this prophecy, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. John to the seven churches which are in Asia, grace be unto you, and peace from him which is, and which was, and which is to come, and from the seven spirits which are before his throne, and from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness, and the first begotten of the dead, and the prince of the kings of the, of the earth, unto him that loved us, and washed us from our sins in his own blood, and hath made us kings and priests unto God and his Father. <clears throat> to him be glory and dom dominion for ever and ever. Amen. Behold, he come, he come with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him, and all king on all kindreds of the earth shall wail because of him. Even so, Amen. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the ending, saith the Lord, which is, which was, and which is to come, the Almighty. I, John, who also I am your brother and companion in tribulation, and in the kingdom and patience of Jesus Christ, was in the what was in the isle that is called Patmos, for the word of God and for the testimony, testimony of Jesus Christ. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day and heard behind me a great voice as of a trumpet, saying, I am Alpha and Omega, the first and the last. And what thou seest, write in a book and send it unto the seven churches which are in Asia, unto Ephesus, unto um, Sirena, unto Sirena, and unto Pergamos, and unto Thyatira, and unto Sardius, and unto Philadelphia, and unto um, Laodiasa. And I turned to see the voice that spake with me, and being turned, and I saw seven golden candlesticks. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, clothed with a garment down to the foot, and girt about the paths with a golden girdle. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were as, as a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace and his voice as the sound of many waters. And he had in his right hand seven stars, and out of his mouth went a sharp two-edged sword. And his countenance was as the sun shineth in his strength. And when I saw him, I fell at his feet as dead. And he laid his right hand upon me, saying unto me, Fear not, I am the first and the last. I am, I am he that liveth and was dead, and behold, I am alive forevermore. Amen. 
and have the keys of hell and of death. Write, this, write the things which thou hast seen, and the things which are, and the things which shall be hereafter, the mystery of the seven stars with, with thou, which thou saw, sawest is in my right hand, and the seven golden candlesticks. The seven stars are the angels, are the angels of the seven churches, and the seven candlesticks which thou sawest are the seven churches. Unto the angel of the church of Ephesus write, These things saith he that holdeth the seven stars in his right hand, who walketh in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks. I know thy works, and thy labor, and thy patience, and how thou, and how thou canst not bear them which are evil, and thou hast tried them which they say, which say they are apostles and are not, and hast found them liars, and hast borne, and hast patience, and for my name's sake hast labored, and hast not fainted. Nevertheless, I have somewhat against thee, because thou hast left thy first love. Remember therefore from whence thou art fallen, and repent, and do the first works, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will remove thy candlestick out of his place, except thou repent. But this thou hast, that thou hatest the deeds of the Nicolaitans, which I also hate. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. To him that overcometh will I give to eat of the tree of life, which is in the midst of the paradise of God. And unto the angel of the church in <clears throat> Semana Sem write, This thing saith the first and the last, which was dead and is alive. I know thy works, and tribulation, and poverty, but thou art rich. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews, and they are not, but are the synagogue of Satan. Fear none of those things which thou shalt suffer. Behold, the devil shall cast some of you into prison, that ye may be tried, and ye shall have tribulation ten days. Be thou faithful unto death, and I will give thee a crown of life. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. He that overcometh shall not be heard of the second death. And to the angel of the church in Pergamos write, These things saith he which hath the sharp sword with two edges. I know thy works, and where thou dwellest, even where Satan's seat is, and thou holdest fast my name, and hast not denied my faith, even in those days wherein Antipas was my faithful martyr, who was slain among you, where Satan dwelleth. But I have a few things against ye, but I have a few, a few things against thee, because, because thou hast feared them that hold the doctrine of Balaam, of Balaam, which taught <clears throat> Balak to cast a stumbling block before the children of Israel, to eat things sacrificed unto idols, and to commit fornication. So hast thou also that hold, so hast thou also them that hold the doctrine of the Nicolaitans, which thing I hate. Repent, or else I will come unto thee quickly, and will fight against them with the sword of my mouth. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches, to him that overcometh, will I give to eat of the hidden manna, and will give him a white stone, and in the stone a new name written, which no man knoweth, saying he that receiveth it. And unto the angel of the church in Thyatira write, These things saith the Son of God, who hath his eyes like unto a flame of fire, and his feet are like fine brass. I know thy works, and charity, and service, and faith, and thy patience, and thy works, and the last to be more than the first. Notwithstanding, I have a few things against thee, because thou sufferest that woman Jezebel, which calleth herself a prophetess, to, to teach and, and <clears throat> to seduce my servants to commit fornication, and to eat things sacrificed unto idols. And I gave her space to repent of her fornication, and she repented not. Behold, I will cast her into a bed, 
and then that commit adultery with her into great tribulation, except they repent of their deeds. And I will kill her children with death, and all the churches shall know that I am he which searcheth the reins and hearts, and I, I will give unto every one of you according to your works. But unto you I say, and unto the rest in Thyatira, as many as I have not this doctrine, and which have not known the depths of Satan, as, I, as they speak, I will put upon you none other burden, but that which ye have already hold fast till I come. And he that overcometh, and kept and kepteth my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations, and he shall rule them with a rod of iron, as the vessels of the potter shall they be broken to shivers, even as I received of my father. And I will give him the morning star. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. And unto the angel of the churches in Sardis write, These things saith he that hath the seven spirits of, the God, of God and the seven stars. I know thy works, and thou hast the name that thou livest, and are dead. Be watchful and strengthen the things which remain, that are ready to die. For I have not found thy works perfect before God. Remember therefore how thou hast received and heard, and hold fast, and repent. If therefore thou shalt not watch, I will come on thee as a thief, as a thief, and thou, thou shalt know, and thou sh shalt not know, what hour I will come upon thee? Thou hast a few names, even in Sardius, which I have, which have not defiled their garments, and they, and they shall walk with me in white, for they are worthy. He that overcometh, the same shall be clothed in white raiment, and I will not blot out his name out of the book of life, but I will confess his name before my Father, and before his angels. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia, write, These things saith he that is holy, he that is true, he that hath the key of David, he that openeth, and no, no man shutteth, and shutteth, and no man openeth. I know thy works, behold, I have set before thee an open door, and no man can shut it, for thou hast a little strength, and hast kept my word, and hast not denied my name. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which they say are Jews, and are not, but do, die, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come, I will make them to come and worship b before thy feet, and to know that I have loved thee, because thou hast kept the word of my patience. I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon all the world, to try them and that dwell upon the earth. Behold, I come quickly. Hold that fast which thou hast, that no man take thy crown. Him that overcometh will I make a pillar in the temple of my God, and he shall go no more out. And I will write upon his name of my God, and the name of the city of my God, which is New Jerusalem, which cometh down out of heaven from my God, and I will write upon him my new name. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches, and unto the angel of the church of Laodicea. La Odyssea. La Odyssea. La Odyssea. La Odyssea. Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce that. Laodiceans, right. These things saith that Amen, the faithful and true witness, the beginning of the creation of God. I know thy works, that thou art neither cold nor hot. I would thou were cold or hot. So then before thou art lukewarm, and neither cold nor hot, and neither cold nor hot, I will spew thee out of my, out of my mouth. Because, because thou sayest, I am rich, and increased with goods, and have need of nothing, and knowest not that thou art wretched, and miserable, and poor, and blind, and naked. I counsel thee to buy of me gold tried in the fire, that thou mayest be rich, and white raiment, 
that thou mayest be clothed, that the, same, that the shame of thy nakedness do not appear, and anoint thine eyes with eyes, eyes salve, that thou mayest see. As many as I love, I rebuke and chasten, and chasten. Be, zeal, be zeal, uh, zealous, therefore, and repent. Behold, I stand at the door, and knock, if any man hear my voice, and open the door, I will come into him, and will sup with him, and he with me. To him that overcometh, will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame, and I am set down with my father in his throne. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit saith unto the churches. Oh, Jesus. So, Revelation chapter 1 to 3, KJV. Oh my God, this takes me so much, so much effort to just read. Ah, oh, Jesus. So, you know, um, I, I I would like to to share you know a secret uh, w w uh, of mine w with you guys you know in this filming session you know, in in fact you know um, I used you know I I indulged myself in lustful sins in um, in pornography quite quite a lot. Especially most recently, and uh, you know, there, there, there was some sort of, uh, um, there were some instances, you know, in 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 which I I find myself, you know, um, these the um, these sen the sorry, desynthesized or. You know, desynthesized to the pleasure of uh, fapping and some some other explicit images. You know, and uh, you know, during the period period of time, you know, when I when I became you know extremely depressed and uh, lonely and uh, helpless. You know, you know, and that occurred. You know, in my you know, in the last se several days of my exile slash homelessness, you know, w which just um, you know e ended no no more than than two months ago, you know, and uh, it's it's been some something like a few weeks, let's just say maybe four or five weeks um, after I, you know, I I was you know rescued by an by an aunt by an aunt and uh, an uncle of mine so I, I don't know if it has something to do with the Holy Spirit or anything you know that you know my those um, feelings or anything you know the, I, I don't know if um, if God use suicidal thoughts and intrusive thoughts to discipline me or anything um, but um, even even if I there even if I I tried so hard you know not not to sin for maybe a week or so you know or actually less than a week maybe five days w without um, pornography or fapping or neither and I still feel the pain you know I still experience trials and tri tribulations pretty much all the time um, it is so weird man. I just have no idea, and I keep for um, forgetting the meaning of words. Um, not just, you know, not just my, you know, the the words, the vocabularies in my first language, but the, you know, my my mother language, which is Mandarin Chinese. But I buy. You know, in English too, but um, um, it's just um, you know, life itself for forever remains a mystery to to me, and uh, I can't even know, you know, 
what's you know what on earth is going on ar around me except except you know more pain and more trials and tribulations and I do still fear um, that one day you know and, and I know that day is is just inevitable that I will lose my grandma though my grandma is currently quite alive and well it still um, pains me greatly and it worries me greatly to 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 just know the inevitability the finality of her of of everyone and uh, maybe sometimes as far as i can perceive death carries its own carries with its own merits that we don't because as long as we live in this world we will continue to to suffer and to sin um i i i'm still pretty much con convinced that it is impossible for us to stop sinning completely as long as we we are trapped and stranded in this ro rotten piece of flesh that are doomed to to fail you know one day and re return to the dust you know from from which we are made and so and uh you know sadly for me in maximum i still have something like 80 years or even you know at least you know at in maximum 80 years at most to live you know to to the while in you know this you know shite planet we call earth and that's um i i don't know if this it is a blessing or a, or a curse or both actually it's kind of both so thanks again for watching and listening um i don't i don't suppose i have time to read another version of the bible you know for tonight um so yeah i'll see you guys in the next videos on youtube um thanks and god bless and let's hope god won't chasten me with more pain and suffering that are so unbearable like suicidal thoughts and choose the thoughts, you know. Okay, bye bye. Cheers.